Hello. For many of us, it's a grey and gloomy picture, misty, murky, drizzly as well. That's how it's going to stay through most of the weekend. And there's no real change on the way for much of next week as well. So this is the satellite picture. You can see the high pressure there centred in the North Sea, the winds blowing around it. But where the winds are a little bit stronger in the north of Scotland and go over the mountains, well, the clouds do tend to break up a little bit. So actually some of us are in for some sunshine through the course of today. It's certainly not gloomy everywhere. Now, through the course of the night, where the skies remain clear, for example, northern and eastern Scotland, it will turn a little colder. So that means that in the morning on Sunday, perhaps only four degrees in Aberdeen. But for many of us stuck underneath that cloud, it'll be closer to 10. Mist and drizzle for a time in the morning with this very slow moving air of high pressure. Again, some of us will have a little bit of sunshine. There's probably going to be a little bit more brightness tomorrow, but it's not a guarantee. And actually for many of us, it'll be exactly the same. Temperatures, exactly the same. Mid-teens, generally speaking, across the UK, but where you've got the sunshine, it'll feel more pleasant. Remember, chilly morning though in Aberdeen. Now the high pressure is with us in the week ahead. In fact, it extends right across Central Europe all the way towards the Balkans. The weather system's making a detour to the North Atlantic and then sweeping across the Norwegian Sea. But we're in that calm area of weather with light winds and that does mean thick fog for some of us early on Monday morning. It will clear in the afternoon and lift to those low grey skies, the stratus cloud. But some sunshine is certainly in the forecast. I'm thinking that parts of East Anglia, the south, and some of these western coasts will get a bit of brightness through the course of the day. So it's not going to be gloomy all through the course of the week. Now, one side of the high pressure, we've got mild air. The other side of the high pressure, closer to lows, it's cold air. But we're in that warmth. And actually, through the course of the week, the temperatures may rise as we see that air streaming in from the southern climes. In fact, it's not impossible. We could see temperatures as high as 17, 18, maybe even 19 degrees in one or two favoured spots. But I think for most of us, it'll be around the mid-teens and not a lot of change in these weather icons, generally rather cloudy. That's it for me. Bye-bye.